What the fuck? I need to fix my camera. Hang on. Jay Ajayi to the Philadelphia Eagles? Listen. Okay. <laughs> what... What are the Philadelphia Eagles organization doing in the front office? I mean, granted, <clears throat> granted, I'm not upset about picking up Jay Jai, but what was their mindset picking up Jay Ajayi? I mean, I just, I'm so confused on why we picked up a running back in the, for the trade deadline. When we have fucking six on our roster, we have LeGarrette Blunt, Wendell Smallwood, Corey Clement, Darren Sproles, Kenyon Barner, Donald Pumphrey <coughs> on the on the IR. That makes seven running backs that we have. And we traded a fourth round pick away for him. Which is a steal, I might add. I mean, that's a steal. Jay Ajayi is a very young, young running back. And he's had a couple of flashes of here and there in his, uh, I believe, two to three year season in the NFL. Um, I believe his numbers are like almost 2,000 with nine touchdowns. I know he has like four um, 200 yard rushing games. Um. I'm just really confused on the process of Howie Roseman to go after and pick up a running back before the trade deadline when clearly we needed help at the offensive line position and at the linebacker position. Those are obviously the two factors that we needed. Now getting Jay Ajayi means that we've now, now we have, we pretty much have the rock and sock connection with him and Blunt, okay? You're rolling those G's gonna be roll. They're gonna be rolling those J's and rolling those blunts up, okay? But what does this mean for Legarra Blunt? Does this Legarra Blunt's gonna be off the team by the deadline? It's in a half hour the trade deadline, so I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know if that means that we're gonna dump our whole fucking team because at the point at this point, I mean, if we trade it for a J J, he is our number one running back. I mean, that's. It's honestly as simple as that. He's going to be the guy that gets the blunt of the ball. Because I don't know. I I I, I don't know. I'm very excited. I, I I don't understand the I don't understand the 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 situation. But it's probably because um defenses have like blitzed the absolute living piss out of us, and all these games like the the they the, we've been getting blitzed so much. And just Carson Wentz has been taking so many hits. I think that we picked up Jay Ajayi for that reason because he's a very good run block. He's very good at picking up blitzes, and he's very good at um, just picking up sp specific guys on the defensive side of the ball. And obviously, he's a great runner. I mean, it did, you know, his numbers, you know, for two years, like I said, two thousand, almost two thousand and nine touchdowns. I guess you just have to trust the process, Howie. <laughs> I mean, we are physically just, we are out. Like, the, the amount of, like, next year's draft, we're not going to pick. We're not going to pick next year in next year's draft at this point. I mean, we don't have second, we don't have, what, second, third? We don't have a second or third round pick. We'll probably end up losing our first round pick for something at this point. I really don't know. Um... Do I expect anything else to happen before the trade deadline? And I believe it's a half hour. I don't expect anything. Like I did, like I said, I didn't expect anything to begin with. I didn't expect us to get Jay Ajayi for a fourth round pick from the Dolphins. I mean, I think that he was probably he was probably un, not undersold by being like it was a steal, like a fourth round pick for Jay Ajayi. He's alive. Like the kid's young. He's obviously talented. But obviously, he was having a very, very uh, down year in Miami. But Miami stinks this year. Like they're they're both. Once Tannehill went down, that that offense was horrible. Even with Adam Gase as their head coach, um, the offensive line's horrible. They can't control the ball, and it sucks because they have so many good. Like with it, 
between Ajahi, Jarvis Landry, Kenny Stills, Devontae Parker. They have so many good guys. I mean, Julius Thomas is even having a decent year for them until uh, Cutler went down, So and now Matt Morrison. But I just – I don't understand. And uh, obviously, I haven't had time to watch. I just woke up like a couple – like about 25 minutes ago, and then I got a 1,000 text messages from everyone saying, oh, my God, uh, we got Jay Ajayi. So I haven't been able to watch like the Howie Roseman. I'm sure – that there's a Hobby Roseman interview. I'm sure that there's going to be a Jay Jahi interview. I'm sure NFL Network has blown all the coverage up about it. So we'll see what happens. But Jay Jahi to the to the Philadelphia Eagles. We have the we're going to be roll, we're going to be rolling the Jays and rolling the blunts, baby. Oh my God.